My name is William Cavadas. I'm the West Bridgewater Acting Highway Superintendent. And the South Street Bridge has been down for, I think, two or three years now. It's finally got state approval to go ahead and repair the bridge. And the procedure now is to install those big uh, aluminum tube and pipe you see over there. It's called the water diversion. diverting the water from one side of the river to the other side. Those those tubes are only a temporary thing. They will, at the, when the bridge is all done and complete, those tubes will all be removed and the facade will be all a stone facade on the side of the bridge and uh, be no uh, metal structures like it was in the past underneath the, for the water to deteriorate and, and rot. It ought to be quite a nice looking bridge if, uh, if I had the plan here I could show it to you but it's a, it's a fine looking bridge when it's done. And right now those metal things are also going to help the heron. The heron season's coming up in March and April, and what they do is they put stones inside those metal things where the heron have a place to mill around and, and still be able to get up river and do their thing and have their eggs and stuff like that. Where it's not supposed to hit the heron run at all, which everybody was worried about that uh, being this time of the year, spring right around the corner. So that's supposed to all been looked at by Com uh, and conservation and all that stuff. And it's all systems go. They, they, how how long the project is going to be extended because of the weather, I really don't know, but I really think that within this time next year we'll be driving over a new bridge.